what was where did the idea for what works come from because you you're the one who created what works um, where did that come from well I'm uh, I'm a military brat my dad was in the Navy um, I we before my dad retired no 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 uh, yeah before my dad retired I spent four years in Hawaii and before that four years in a place called Midway Island which is at the very very far um, uh, western tip of the Hawaiian Islands. Okay, it's a uh, one mile by two mile island. They had a big uh, battle there in World War II, and a big naval barrage battle. And so, one eighth of the island was cement, and that's where wow. the housing was. That's where the exchange was and stuff. And the rest of it was forest restricted area. Yeah. But I was a preteen. Yeah. So you wanted to get get in trouble. Yeah. So that whole area was our kingdom of course. to explore. In fact, to get in my club, you had to dig around um, all over an island, and if you found your own bayonet shovel, you could join my team. <laughs> <laughs> but that's where I started playing, because, I mean, seriously, you could walk a mile into the, to, to the forest, and there's a pillbox. I mean, a full, pristine pillbox. That, that, that didn't get hit at, at, at the time and they just left it out there. Wow. Um, there were a big huge artillery installation things. There were warehouses full of stuff. There were, there were I mean, ammo shell, empty ammo shell casings this big and stuff. I mean, so as a little kid, you could imagine yourself in, in that uh, world and all using all that stuff that's around you and yeah. experimenting with it and having fun with it. Mm -hmm. So all my dreams, well, not all my dreams, all my fantasies as a little, little um, a bratty kid uh, was developed there. And then so when it came time to image where, okay, we're going to do this and, oh no, we've got to actually create something first before we try it. You know, this is our own stuff. This is not, you know, we're not working for somebody like Marvel. Yeah. And so, of course, you know, we were all practical enough, okay, do what you're always told as a writer, right? Yeah. Do what you know. And that's what I knew. I knew military guys. And then um, Brandon Choi, who wrote both Wildcats and Wetworks, um, he had, we, we lucked out because he was in San Diego, uh, other than being Jim's best friend, he was in San Diego because he was trying out for the SEALs. Um, but he, uh, I think, sprained his ankle on the course. Um, and so was thinking about what to do, whether to go back into law or, or, or join up with us. And it turns out he was, well, obviously, he was going to join the He wanted to be a, a Navy SEAL. So we got together and hit it off real well. And he then brought into the mix, oh, uh, Classic Monsters, the copyright's up. We could, it's free now. It, it's open. We can use it. And so, oh, cool. We needed an enemy. So he got it. Yeah. <laughs>